The value proposition here is that most of us spend time reacting to client demands and not proactively getting in front of clients on a regular basis. And the way to, the way to build a growth engine in your business is to become a growth engine in your client's business. Let me give you an example. We hired, I was having a conversation yesterday with someone about the design as a service world, right? So Design Pickle, Dear Designer, these guys are basically $400 a month for unlimited design services, right? Now here's a statistic that'll blow your mind. I'm not gonna tell you which one it is, but one of these big design as a service agencies, they onboard 350 new clients a month. They onboard 350 new clients a month. They churn 300 clients a month, right? So they are working extremely hard and spending an enormous amount of money on advertising to basically gain 50 new clients a month. Now, why do they churn? We hired one of these design agencies to help us with some overflow because Ben couldn't physically manage all the design work we had, right? After about three months, we were like, nah, we don't really need them at the moment. We don't really need much design work at the moment. So we're just going to put it on. We're just going to cancel the account, right? Now they allowed me, because I have a good relationship with them, they allowed me to pause my account. So they just pause your account, which means when you come back in the future, you've still got that same designer. You've still got that relationship with that dedicated designer. Okay, cool. Simon and I were talking about this yesterday. And I said, if they were more proactive in just talking to me about what I need in the business, I'm convinced they could talk me into designing something for us every week here in the business if it was going to help us grow. Facebook ads, infographics for our blog posts, you know, a, a physical prospectus to send out the people in the mail for Mavericks Club. The reality is they're not talking to me about my business. They're just taking orders and responding, right? So I churned on them. I went, you know what? We don't need you anymore. We're about to reactivate them because we do need them. But in the meantime, they've lost two months revenue from me because they are not a growth engine for me. They're not helping me grow. They're just reacting. They're just an order taker. So the value proposition here is that you can build a growth engine in your business where you reduce your churn. You just have clients who hang around forever because you've become, in, you've become integral to their growth, okay? Mm -hmm.